and welcome to our first morning meeting. I'm excited to have everybody back here in the building. Uh, we're off to a great start. Um, our morning meetings serve three purposes. First, we wanna hear about the great things that are going on in your classrooms. We know so many of you are working hard in class, getting your work finished, and we wanna hear about those things. Second, this is an opportunity for us to give you some reminders, um, maybe about walking uh, procedures out to the bus, reminding you to wear your mask, um, how we go into the cafeteria, those types of things. And third, and my favorite, is for us just to have fun together, to build relationships, have some friendly competition within homerooms, and uh, just get to know each other a little bit better as one big K's family. So thanks for being here. We're off to a great start. Go Cougars. Good morning, Cougars. It's Mrs. Renfro here. I just wanted to take a second to highlight something that's going really well, and that's you guys following safety procedures. You guys are doing a wonderful job wearing your mask, just like me. You guys are staying socially distanced, you're washing your hands, and I'm really proud of you for doing such a nice job and taking this so seriously. It's so important that we continue to do this so that we can stay in school and we can all be safe. Now, for a reminder, I want you guys to think about your classwork. As I'm sure you've noticed, you guys have started diving into more challenging classwork. As a result, you might get things that are a little bit difficult for you or that you don't understand, and that's okay. What's not okay is shutting down, refusing to work, being rude to your teacher, and not giving your best effort. That's never okay. I believe that we are the best school in Evansville, and I know you guys believe that too. I will say it over and over again to anyone who will listen. Kays is the best school in Evansville. To show people that we're the best school in Evansville, we are going to have to be hard workers. So when something is challenging or hard or new or different, what we need you to do is to try your best, be patient, ask for help from either a student or your teacher and always, always, always continue to strive to get better and keep a great attitude. You guys are gonna learn so much this year and it's gonna continue to be a wonderful year. Keep up the great work and let's show everyone how strong Kays is. Hi, I wanna give a shout out to Abby in my classroom. She is so kind to everyone and just a friend to everybody. She's really nice. Great job, Abby. My shout out is to Rylan Bloomer in Mr. Benji's class. He's a hard worker and he always does the right thing. And my other shout out is to Miss Kay. She works really hard in the first grade classroom and she's helped cover for me when I had jury duty and she always loves working with the kids. Hey guys, Miss Olson here. I just want to shout out to my whole class in second grade. You guys are doing so amazing, working so hard. Keep it up. I'm so proud of you. Bye. Hey guys, Mr. Crow's going to be going around the building this next month and I want to see you use yes ma'am. No ma'am, yes sir, no sir. I want you to use your manners because this month I'm gonna be checking and that's who's gonna get the shout out next month are the ones that are using their manners and saying thank you and please, not talking when somebody else is talking. That's what I'm looking for, so I'll be watching for you. So make sure you use your best manners. Hi everybody. My shout out today is to all of Kay's teachers and staff. Um, specifically, I have seen admits a year of adversity. You all really come together in a positive way. And also all the work that you all put in to get your classrooms safe and cute and start the year with some really quality learning. So thank you for all that time that you're putting in for this year. Thanks. Hi, Kay's Cougars. I just want to give a shout out to, I have two shout outs actually. I want to give a shout out to, first of all, everyone here at Kay's for just being so awesome and adjusting to these big changes here with uh, with COVID-19. And I know it's not exactly how we imagine coming back to school, but you guys have made the best of it. So thank you. And I also want to give a shout out to my student ambassadors for this year. I want to give a shout out to Reese, Olivia, Niseni, Brian, Jayshawn, Kinsey, Kavion, Isabel, Isidin, Zakaria, Katura, and Ramayas. Welcome aboard and great job, guys. Keep it up. My students, thank you for staying on task and being dedicated to learning. I do love that you come to school every day with a positive attitude. It makes me have a positive attitude coming to work to see you every day. 
Hi, I just want to give a shout out to Mrs. Piercy's third grade class. You guys are doing great this year. I love how focused you are, and I'm excited to continue to grow and learn with you. Hey guys, I want to give a shout out to Tressel and Ellis because whenever we're in math, she works so hard, she does her best, and she doesn't let getting a problem wrong get her down. I love her attitude and I wish everyone was just like Tressel and Ellis. I want to give a shout out to Leona Yu for always being willing to help others and also to three boys who have, in my class who have been showing academic excellence in math. So Isidin, Reggie, and Elijah. I want to say congratulations to my class. You guys have been working so hard on, in class, staying focused and ignoring any distractions to improve your learning. Excellent job, guys. Shout out to my entire class for doing such a great job wearing their masks the first couple weeks of school. They've earned cupcakes two weeks in a row. And a shout out to Nisani, Tiara, Anthony, MJ, and Javion for consistently participating in our classroom discussions. Good job, guys. Hello again, Cougars. I have a couple of shout outs from our staff members that I'd like to read aloud. The first one is from Miss Holiday, our nurse, and she would like to give a shout out to our cafeteria staff, especially Amber, for going above and beyond when taking care of staff and student lunches. We know you guys have a lot of new things to do this year, and we're so thankful for everything you've done to help make lunch and breakfast smooth. Also, we'd like to shout out Mr. Darren, our head custodian, for attention to detail with safety issues and also doing a great job monitoring the AC. Way to go, Mr. Darren. I also have a shout out from Miss Stratman. She would like to shout out her entire class. Oh my goodness. She said, I really pushed them this week with math and reading content, not to mention a science project. They worked so hard and stayed focused so we could reach our goals. Seriously, when I think of how much I was able to get done this past week with them, my heart is filled with so much pride. Wonderful job, Mrs. Stratman's class. And the last shout out comes from Miss Dressler and it's to Mrs. Reich. Miss Dressler would like to shout out Mrs. Reich for doing a wonderful job and being creative with virtual homework. Instead of giving homework that kids take home and they bring back, she is having all homework done on Class Dojo and it's working out so well. Great job, Mrs. Reich. All right, now we're gonna go to our third part of our morning meetings, and that is we are gonna have some fun. How many of you guys have ever heard of Where's Waldo? Raise your hand. All right, well, if you haven't heard of Where's Waldo, what happens is you see a picture with a lot of different things going on, and you try to find all the different pictures of Waldo. We are gonna do something really similar. This is a K seek and find. So we have Bitmojis, from a lot of the K staff and we put them in a picture. You guys have five minutes to try to find all the different staff members. You can look on the left to find the Bitmoji and the staff member's name and look to the right on the picture to try to find them. How many can your class find in five minutes? We'll see. the challenge all you gotta do is leave it better than you found it it's gonna get difficult to stand but hold your balance i just say whatever cause there is no way you're around everyone falls down sometimes but you just gotta know it'll all be fine it's okay uh -huh, uh -huh. it's okay it's okay When in the walk around the neighborhood Feeling blessed, never stressed Got that sunshine on my Sunday best hey, Some days you wake up and nothing works, you feel surrounded Gotta give your feet some gravity to get you grounded Keep your... Yeah. 
got this feeling inside my bones. It goes electric, wavy when I turn it on. All from my city, all from my home. We're flying up, no ceiling when we in our zone. I got that sunshine in my pocket. Got that good soul in my feet. I feel that hot blood in my body when it drops. Ooh, I can't take my eyes off of it. Moving so phenomenally. Come on, lock the way we rock it. So don't stop. And under the lights, when everything goes, nowhere. Stop the, I can't stop the feeling. Nothing I can see but you when you dance. 